Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 899 of Fallout 4. We're at the last episode of the 800s. It's happening. Oh dang. Also, the Sangler is totally twitching. It's kind of weird. But uh, last episode, we finished things up at the bowling alley. We uh, unlocked modified bowling balls that we can put in a fat man and launch them. Sounds pretty freaking awesome. Resume the grid pattern, and we're heading back east toward the Far Harbor area. And the only thing we have left to explore in all of Far Harbor is this little bit of my map. That's it. That's all we got. We're making some sick progress, if I do say so myself. We're heading over to some kind of down plane over here to just investigate the wreckage. See, I'm, I am totally stuck to see if there's any loot there, but uh, that is the plan. Hopefully, of course, you guys are enjoying the Fallout videos. I, again, do appreciate those you take the time to like the videos, and I thank you dudes for the support. It really helps out. But, yeah, let's go see what this plane crash is all about, shall we? I gotta get in the habit of sprinting again. I'm in the habit of being overweight from carrying tons and tons of garbage, so I walk around third person, and I keep forgetting to sprint. Now we're slightly detected, and I'm not gonna lie, this looks really freaking cool. Look at that. So that's the down plane, obviously, and look at all like, the random lighting. What's that about? And I think the game even just played some kind of like fancy music there for a sec. You know, your fancy discovery music. So what's here? What's detecting me? This looks really cool. Neat. Oh, Gabe, yeah, don't do that. It always does that. I don't know why. It's been a weird thing it's been doing lately. It's like, oh my god, you can't keep up with save files. Nice little, uh, little, little, little waterfall we got here. Don't mind if I uh, scale that with my jetpack. So what is, uh, what's, what's latching on to me here? I don't, I don't see anything. Oh, we're getting closer to whatever it is. Ah, Longfellow fell and broke his leg. Maybe there's like a ghoul just chilling in the plane or something? Man, look at those girthy engines on the turbines or jets or whatever. It'd be jets. Look at those jets. That's nuts. I, mean, I guess it could be a turbine because they technically the other. Uh, this is the front of the plane. Who knows? This is Fallout stuff. There's doggos in there. Who knows? This is this is Fallout logic. It could just be an attack helicopter for all I know. I don't know what it identifies as. But, uh, hi dogs. Pork, pork. They're named Duke and Mishka. That's you. Gracie! Yeah, Gracie looks like a meme. Is there a person just chilling in here? I swear, that sounds awesome. Ooh. Uh, please no kill. Please talk to me. Let's be friends. Sure you want to be out and about and you has doggos. Let's be friends. Watch me like a super mutant or something stupid. Like, why would, why would a person have a mutant town? Oops. I stole some things. I didn't know that was theft. Don't tell. Don't tell Mishka. Don't tell Gracie. Don't tell the doggos. I stole the thing. I stole it. <laughs> Shh. It was accidental. I thought it was mine. <laughs> I thought it was anybody who wanted it. <laughs> All right. So note to self, everything here is off limits. Can't touch it. At least for the most part, until you find some like random thing that's not marked. Can, can we just be friends? Can we? Can we not kill each other? You don't seem to mind if I take your erratic grad stag meat that you just painstakingly killed and brought back Come home. Come on out, stranger. This doesn't have to get messy. Oh, Pug Champ. Erickson, that you out there? Long fellow? You're still alive, eh? Well, tell your friend to come on out here. I'm here. I've had dealings with him before. Not a bad sort. Oh, that's awesome. I'm a super mutant who doesn't hate her guts. Terminal that we can totally hack here. Well, not expecting to find a super mutant that, uh, uh, much less one willing to talk to us, but a super mutant nonetheless up here with doggos. Hey, dude. What hey. were you doing up there in my camp? I stole nothing. Nice hat. Nice hat. Oh, uh, thanks. I skinned it myself. You're not looking at Look, me. Look, I don't really want any trouble. I broke off from the group I came here with a long time ago. I just start. No. No, no. Dialogue. D d d dialogue. 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 No. Dialogue. Game one. You guys, all right? Yeah, you're good, Longfellow. Good to see you're still kicking. <laughs> yeah, you too. You vouching for him? 
Sorry about pointing a gun. Okay. Please tell me. Yeah, okay. Thank God for auto says, but folks, you use quick save and fall out. You're a fucking scumbag douchebag. God. This this is why I this 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 is why quick saves. Are you out there? Are nice. Wrong fellow? Hey. You're still alive, eh? Right here. Tell your friend to come on out here. I've had dealings okay. with him before. Not a bad sort. Hey. What were you doing up there in my camp? Nothing. Um, nice hat. Nice hat. Ugh. Thanks. I skinned it myself. Look. Hey. You do not seem to you do not Yeah. You do, you do not seem to like dialogue. Yeah! Alright, uh maybe I should wait for him to go toward the center of the room, or maybe wait for him to sit in his chair. Erickson, that you out there? Maybe it's good. Long fellow? You're still alive, eh? I'll tell your friend to come on out here. I've had dealings with him before. Not a bad sort. Freaking Bethesda. And they're stupid. Now I'm just going to wait for him to sit in his chair. You go sit in your throne thingy over there, dude. That way, yeah. Like, he, what he wants to do is he wants to walk over there. And for some reason, he also got up earlier. I think it's messing with the dialogue. He's like in an animation. What were you doing up there in my camp? Let me compliment your hat, please. Nice hat. Ugh. Thanks. Every time I come on this hat, he gets myself. angry. Look, I don't really want any trouble. I broke off from the group I came here with a long time ago. I just started seeing things differently when we. Yeah. Yeah. You guys all. Yeah. You too. You vouched for him. You should never have vouched for me. I'm sorry, dogs. I'm not sorry, Erickson. It pained me more to shoot the doggo than it does you. Ah! Alright, game. Last try before I give up completely. This game sometimes is a steaming pile of shit when it wants to be. Erickson, <laughs> that you out there? For some reason, every time, mid dialogue, alive, eh? he moves to do something. It's almost like here. he's. Like the dogs are doing something. With him before. And then he has to go Not check on them. I, I don't know what it is. I've waited for him to go over there, and he sat and he stood still. So, I'm just gonna sit here. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna be a patient boy. I'm just gonna sit here. We're, we're, just, we're just not gonna, like, blood rage murder some doggos. See, now he's standing over there. Hey, can I compliment your hat this time? Hey. Hey. What were you doing up there in my camp? Complimenting your hat. Nice hat. Ugh. Thanks. I skinned it myself. Look. I don't really want any trouble. I broke off from the group I came here Stay. with a long time ago. Stay! I just started seeing things. I keep to myself up here and train my dogs. Do a bit of trade with people, too. At least those that don't open fire on me. Don't see any reason we can't do the same. Come on up if you'd like. Dialogue. Dialogue. Alright, now that you guys all right? Now that that's done. Yeah, you're good. Longfellow. Good to see you're still kicking. Yeah, you too. You vouching for him? Sorry about pointing a gun at you earlier. I just get a bit jumpy when a stranger might be killing my dogs. What are you talking about? I never did that. I would never. Looking to trade? Maybe. So, why don't you hate humans like the rest of your kind seem to? Started seeing things more clearly when we came here. Who knows? Maybe it's the fog. I just don't see what the point of us all killing each other is. Did you train these dogs? Yeah, as guard dogs. Not all can be trained, though. Most are used to being kicked or shot at. I can only manage a few at a time, though. So unless I find a new home for one of them, I can't really take on any more. I'll take one. I'll take one. I was interested in buying one of your guard dogs. Which one would you like? All of them. All of them. Give me the wolfy. I'd like to buy the wolf. Where did you want it to guard? Go Longfellow's cabin? Longfellow's cabin? 
Yes! Treat them right, and they'll do the same for you. Yeah! Yeah! Hey, Wolfie! Hey! I can't talk to you. Well, let me talk to Wolfie. That Wolfie needs a sandwich. He's looking very lean. Alright, Mishka. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna give you Gracie now. Or, wait, Duke. You do. Gracie looks evil. There's probably a bed around if you need a rest. No, I want all your dogs. I was interested in buying one of your guard dogs. Give me them all. Buy a wolf. You can just buy a generic wolf. You can just keep buying dogs. I was interested in the dog. Where did you want it to guard? Longfellow's cabin! All the dogs! Yes! Sounds good. You take care. Yeah! Words of wisdom right there. You treat them right, they'll treat you right. That's why dogs and other animals can be dicks, because they're raised by dicks. It's not the animal's fault. <laughs> can't, can't blame the animal for that one. That's just how the person raised it. It's not like a person. They're not really capable of uh, differentiating right from wrong. Uh, well, I stole his dogs. I wonder if he come back here later if he'll randomly have some other dogs. Now, this one just looks like it wants to eat me and uh, all my friends. So, I don't know about that one. That one can stay here. <laughs> Let's see if he's got anything unique for trade. Uh, you hungry? Oh. Here. Hey, it this. just gave me baked bloat fly. What a fucking dude, bro. You just live out here by yourself. My kind are mostly stupid brutes. They used to trade with a couple people in Far Harbor, but they don't leave the settlement much these days. The rest of the people on the island are worse. Got any tips about the island? Hmm. There's a lighthouse on the south end of the island. Big family of trappers lives there. I already killed him. I already killed him. You interested in a trade? Hmm. <sighs> Maybe? Maybe? Let's see. Butcher's Hook. Refills your AP on critical hits. Pretty cool. Bear traps. Uh, some foodsies. He's got a teddy bear. He does have fusion core, so that's pretty cool. I don't think I really have anything to give him right now. I mean, I guess I can give him a pulse grenade. I'm not giving him a cappy glasses, but... Yeah, I dropped everything off. I'm actually gonna pick up, I think, a fusion core. I'll take, I'll take a fusion core. I think a fusion core is alright. Let's, let's do it. Yeah, I traded. I did business with you. There you go, man. I am supporting local businesses. Small businesses. So this was, uh, cool and unexpected. Now, there is a staircase here. But before I go there, I'm wondering, like, does it lead somewhere that maybe I could just fly to? And I also picked up some doggos. That's pretty cool. It does not appear to lead to somewhere that I can just zip on up to, so I guess I have to... Guess I have to hack his terminal. Then again, that wasn't really his terminal. It was the plane's terminal. My terminal now, regardless. Oh god, this is like really lopsided and awkward. Okay, reside. Mm, it could be the E. Okay, healed. Tested. ED. You don't want ED. ED's bad. Uh, tested. Cannot, can't be tested, right? Likeness 4. It's the E and the ED at the end. No, feared. E. A. ED. Feared. Sweet. Easy. Give me that door. Okay, what you got in here? It didn't look like much though, because I couldn't go anywhere when I went up top. Looks Which, like you know your way around a terminal. First you say I know my, my way around a terminal, now you say I know my, my way around a uh, lockpick, and now you say I know my way around this, that, and another thing. Alright, so this is apparently his loot. This is apparently his loot. Well, considering the dude bro gave me a baked bloat fly, just like out of nowhere, he's like, here, take your baked bloat fly. I will, uh, I will not steal his stuff. I enjoyed his company. He was a pretty cool dude. That's my kind of super mutant right there. That was pretty freaking neat though. Not what I was expecting. Bye buddy. You have a, you have a good one. Uh, thanks for the doggos. Uh, if you have any more woofies and doggos, we'll come back here later. <laughs> just keep sending them back. He's way better than Gene. Looks like you can just keep buying animals from him. But Gene only gives you like one doggo once in a blue moon when you find him off in the wild blue yonder walking around because he's never really anywhere in particular. I think he has like a certain subset of paths that he uh, like walks around, but he's not exactly the world's most common NPC. And sometimes he doesn't even have his dogs yet because he's got to like spend time to train them. Yeah, that dude just stayed up and sold me some dogs. I'll take it. My pooch now. <laughs> that was really cool. I like that. That was, that was different. Uh, well, yeah, it's back to the old gridding here. Kind of like in this area. It's a bit open earlier. It was a bit open. It was like fungus off in the trees, and it's very yet atmospheric, 
the whole uh, Far Harbor thing. Can I like, can I, can I, can I, can I get this? No? You know, it's the bane of third person is not being able to loot the fungus. Or the blight, or whatever we're gonna call it. We are going the right way. I feel like I'm going a little bit further south than I should be. Should be going toward, <laughs> should be going toward the marker. I'm getting some mad hops out of this. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, this isn't very deep water at all, is it? Okay, then. I can just walk across this lake. <laughs> Didn't have to fly across the whole thing. So now I gotta scale the mountains. Again, glad I, uh... Glad I, uh, fixed my AP thing here, because having no AP doing this would just be the worst. Yeah, that was that was probably gonna be really painful if I was over encumbered still. I'm getting closer and closer, I think, to Acadia, right? We're not south of that? Yeah, we're not, we're not south of Acadia yet. I am, however... About to be south of where I'm supposed to be on the grid. So I'm gonna go to the north just a smidge. And I don't remember if this was one of the roads that we walked along, but it's looking like it, so I'm not gonna give it too much focus. I just see a down tractor trailer over there with probably nothing in that one. And I'm hearing crickets. And we're next to a gigantic windmill. Hell yeah. And there is Far Harbor, or at least it's over in that general direction. But here's a good vantage point. Here's the thing with the industrial purifiers, water purifiers. Remember, remember that. I mean, now we're now we're back to familiar area. Frankly, I think I can just turn around at this point and put the marker here. And I'm, I'm gonna go at least look over the edge because I know I've walked through here a few times. I'm just gonna look over. I can avoid scaling this mountain 13 times unnecessarily. Ah, it's a little cul-de-sac thingy. I don't really recall being here. It's a little roundabout, whatever we're gonna call it. I don't really remember being here, to be entirely fair, so I guess I'll give it a thorough look see -loo. Bathroom right there. Everything's just buried. And it won't let me in there. It won't let me in the bathroom! I gotta poop! Even if it's not actually a bathroom and it's just a shower, I still gotta poop. It's better than pooping outside. Somebody's gonna see me. Oh, it's definitely not in this thing. There's any traps. Voltec lunchbox. Hell yeah, I'll take that. Mr. Handy Fuel, some oil never hurt nobody. Mop, boom, take that. Um, that's the house that had those people that said they wanted to eat me or whatever. They're like, oh, I'm gonna eat your ass. And I'm like, oh, um, no. Really? I thought I got stuck there. I'm like, yeah, I'm not, uh, not, not interested in that. And this is, of course, the Red Rocket. So yes, we have been here multiple times. We cleared these dudes out. I'm not gonna worry about this. So let's see here. I'm gonna go down a smidge. No, Kidder Ridge Pass. I'll be honest. That I don't remember. That I don't remember really at all. Maybe... What was that detected? Maybe it's something we marked ourselves? Like maybe we've been there and we saw it in passing? Or maybe we talked to an NPC and they just sort of shot me a quest? I don't really know. Well, there you go. I'm facing the direction I need to go, so let's go back to the west. And maybe we can find some more cool things? Get out of here, albino angler. I'm gonna mag dump in you. Oh. Well. That was a bloody mess. The bloody mess is what hurt me there. <laughs> Rip my power armor arm, my bloody mess is killing it. Hopefully hopefully we can find something really cool. Oh, I got the weapon glitch. Hopefully we can find something really cool like what we just found, but I uh, I kind of doubt it. I think that was kind of one of those once-off, super awesome, unique things they throw at you every now and again in your, uh, your travels. I might need to go back to Far Harbor and do another once-over and talk to all the NPCs there, just to make sure nobody else has a quest available for me, like before we leave. That might need to be a thing that I do. Uh, I I feel like there maybe might it might be something left with the harbor woman. I could be crazy. For some reason I get the feeling that maybe she I like I thought like didn't like did I remember I didn't talk to her or like I, I couldn't talk to her because I had to give it some time or something like that. I don't know, it might be one of those quests you gotta wait and come back to. And I don't remember if I did that the last time. I don't know, she she was just doling out the quests and I, I, I gotta. I probably want to confirm that. So I think like before we leave Far Harbor, probably talk to her once again. Maybe do another once over with all the NPCs there just to see what the hell's what the hell's up. But again, the mountain scaling. It's just yeah. Got about that extra fusion core. I'd be down to three right now. Just so many damn mountains. And this is absolutely the path that Longfellow took us up to go to Acadia. I don't. I full well expect nothing new on those roads. It's the stuff off of the side though that we can still find things like that. I mean shit. M missing out on that super mutant? That'd be sad. That was that was really cool. That dude was a, again total dude bro. Hello, Myler. That was an absolute dude bro. Just just randomly gave me. He owes me nothing. 
just gave me baked bloat. A man slaved over a hot stove and straight up just gave me a baked bloat fly and trying times like these. What a fucking gent. Donk. Donk. I didn't even hit that guy. I hit the, hit the ground next to him and I killed him. So is it a mire lurk or is it just the babies that are detecting me? Or it's about to be a queen who's going to jump out at me. No. Oh, the hunter. Sorry, dude. I don't, I don't want to kill all the babies. I, I, I want to be careful with where I'm shooting here. I would like to loot these eggs. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? I don't know. He was legendary. Legendary Goss Rifle? Oh, it's more damage to ghouls. Here I thought that it was going to be the most amazing. One fellow. Out of the way. Here I thought it was going to be the most amazing thing ever. Technically, I have a Goss Rifle to use now. Oh, there's a, there's a dead person here. They were feeding their, their babies dead people. That's a little bit weird. And again, I mean, we feed our babies dead people. Well, not dead people, but dead animals. I mean, some may, some people maybe feed dead people, but that's probably not legal. But, uh, <laughs> circle of life. All that. Life finds a way. There's a lot of blight. Some of it seems to be lootable. Some of it appears to not be. A lot of people parts just grown into the wall here and grown into the fungus. That's kind of gross. There's like a hand over there. One of these has to spawn a baby that's going to try and eat me. All right. Yeah. Right. Oh. Got him. <laughs> There's something incredibly satisfying about ground pounding Myrlic babies like this in mass, just landing on them and hearing that sound of. Bleh. Okay, so there's just legs. Nope, it's giving me out of the power armor. There's just legs. It's not attached to a corpse. I can't loot it. Uh, it's not often you actually see that. But it's not like an actual body, so much as it probably is just an item. Or something really strange that they put here for an aesthetic. Never had much use for power armor. Too damn noisy to go hunting. Uh, good thing you don't use power armor to hunt. You get a dingle. Hey, buddy. You're legendary. We're just getting dunked on. Where'd you come from, a radiated machete? Like, I was here this whole time. I was killing your friends and family. Also, look at those eyes. That is straight demonic. But... <laughs> Killing your friends and family, eating your babies, ki killing your babies, eating your babies, and then you aggro? What a bad father. What a bad Myler king. Where's the Myler queen when, she, when you need her? She's gonna get really angry with me. Here's the little things that the hermit crabs use. That's kind of funny. There's a suitcase. I love how there's a suitcase and a duffel bag that you could actually loot from that. <laughs> We're coming up on this cavern or whatever it was. Kitteridge Pass. We're a little south of where we need to be, but it was all water, you know, so it doesn't really matter. So let's actually go north a smidge, then go west, and then we'll hit that Kitteridge Pass, whatever it was, on the way back. That makes the most sense. That was a cool little pit stop, but my like set piece. So there's like crosses over there that are on fire, or lit up in some capacity. Spoopy. We be dealing with religious shit. It's always freaky when it involves religious shit. I don't know, man. I've always been, like, disturbed by all the weird shit. Religions and cults and all that crap they do. And people are nuts. Like, what compels a human being to just go down that path? It's like, it ain't logical. It makes no sense. Oh, well, maybe I'm a... Maybe I'm not rational enough. Maybe I value logic too much to understand all of that gobbledygook. But it, uh, never interested me and always confused the shit out of me. Which is why I'm not religious, but the hang man, to each their own. You do you, I'll do me. And then nobody will get arrested. Hell yeah! I'll take the tarberry. I saw a Marlark or something over here, kind of crouched under the ground. Uh, he was, well, he's burrowed. He's at like the top of his shell. Mm, not really seeing much of anything. Am I detected? Yes. There is something here. There could be an angler. I mean, we just killed an angler. Over there at that boat earlier. Lurween. Lurween. Gimme. Gimme. Get, get, get it's, it's so awkward to loot things in third person. It's, it's so painfully awkward. I don't know why it's got to be that way. <laughs> I think we're ready. Yeah, there he is. Blood Rage Mylark. Got you in the butt. I think we're ready to drop down another grid. Okay, he's dead. That crippled him, too. Oh. Something else here. Let me check the map. Uh, so carriage pass, we're on this one. Here's the next one. We're finally coming like right across the Cadia though. I guess that's cool. I hear him. Was that deaf? I was gonna say, I heard him, but I was looking for the red outline and he's just right there with no outline. That's weird. 
Sometimes I've noticed that the power armor targeting helmet just doesn't seem to do what it's supposed to do. So we're out of way, so there should be two dead Mylarks here for me to loot. You! Take you! What's my medical illness thing that I've been randomly given here? Uh, fatigue, require more frequent sleep. I think I'll just use an antibiotic now, and let's use a purifying water and eat some food. Get some AP back. I think it's a good idea. Uh, am I overweight? I'm not overweight. Nice. Let's see, am I where I'm supposed to be? No. I'm starting to go a little south of where I should be, so let's line up and let's start heading to the east, shall we? We go see what Kitter Ridge Pass is supposed to be, because I have no idea. But my dudes, it is time to wrap it up here. Episode 899. Next episode, it's 900. Hell yeah! Get hype! That is, that is, that is, that is insane. Like, <laughs> stop thinking about how many episodes that is. It's just ridiculous. But anyway, guys, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.